Hi there, I'm Brian. I'm going to take a minute to introduce you to Hirobo's brand new SRB Quark helicopter. This little electric helicopter is available ready to fly with everything including the transmitter and also in a version with everything except the transmitter. That way you can use your own 72 megahertz transmitter. As long as you have the correct frequency, uh, you can use Hirobo Genuine Crystals in the helicopter to match the trans the the channel of your transmitter. Um, the Hello Helicopter comes with the transmitter, my version did. comes with the manual, all of them come with that. All of them come with the sticker set that has two different color schemes. Includes the battery charger that is AC powered, so you don't have to have any other separate DC power source in which to charge a battery. Obviously it comes with the battery itself here. It's a two cell 480 milliamp hour lithium polymer battery. Uh, it also comes with some spare rotor blades, four pair of main blades, and then four spare tail blades as well. Kind of handy. We all know that uh, sometimes accidents happen, and it's nice that uh, Hirobo threw in some spares for us there. I'd like to show you the under the canopy here, a really small little heli. It has a tiny little brushless outrunner motor that spins the main rotor there. It has a really small brushed, coreless brushed motor uh, driven, uh, sh shaft driven to the tail rotor for yaw control. Uh, in the front here, this is Hirobo's little all-inclusive electronics board. It's already pre-programmed and tested at the factory. Uh, made, they made sure that it flies, though it is adjustable if it's not flying the way you feel it should. And in, in the manual it has a lot of instructions on how to adjust that. I'm not going to get into that, but uh, it is uh, it does work uh, very well right out of the box. I didn't have to adjust anything. Um, on the other side here, you can see where the crystal is. If you had the version without its own transmitter, this is where you would change the crystal. They want you to use. Make sure you use a Hirobo crystal with that. Um, the blades are made of foam, like the XRB the counter-rotating indoor style helicopter. That way if, it, uh, if you do have a crash within the house and you hit the television or the lamp or something, your wife's not going to kill you. Um, the blades usually just shatter. The helicopter falls almost nine times out of ten harmlessly to the ground. You replace the blades and you're back in business. Um, this helicopter though is made for more than just indoor. It actually does really well outside. Of course, it is small, so a lot of wind is going to be tough for it, but on those real calm days, the quark is a lot of fun outside. It can never do a loop or a roll or any aerobatics like that, but it can pirouette around, which is pretty cool. It does stall turns pretty well, and it actually moves really fast. So it's a lot of fun. In fact, I've had more fun with this than uh, any other style helicopter in a while, I have to admit. The, the quark is a whole new style. Uh, a lot of people started flying with fixed pitch helicopters that honestly were pretty tough to fly. The Quark isn't like that though. They've somehow made it very stable yet responsive enough to be fun for an experienced pilot as well. We're going to show you later on how just how it flies outside and we'll hover it around inside because you can do both with this heli. Uh, Hirobo has its own little teeny micro servos that are already installed with the linkages to the you know the little swash plate here. Like I said, it's totally ready to go. When you open the box, uh, all these are neatly packed, of course, into this box here. Pull it out, pull out the instruction manual. I know everybody is probably going to jump to the how do you charge the battery and how do you fly the helicopter. Uh, jump to the part that talks about charging the battery. Go ahead and get that on charge. And while you're waiting, you may as well read through the rest of the manual. Um, this does work a little bit differently perhaps than other models that you're familiar with. So we'll meet you out back. We'll go fly the quark.